Hi guys, through here with not of it for Blender. This one's gonna be a cool tip for box cutter users. So, due to limitations of Blender's um, uh, local mode, so when I press forward slash, I go to local mode, right? I isolate everything. You can't really avoid certain issues with um, objects that are actually close to whichever you want to cut. So, what I mean by that, you see this. A pillar here which is pretty pretty close right and you got this object here right so when I go to for, um, uh, to local mode by forward slash and I'm going to you know I'll, I'll try to cut this one you know with uh, with a bull you will see that it's parented to the object so box cutter is parenting it but it's misaligned and the reason for it is actually the same happens with decals the reason for it is that a blender when you go to um, you know local mode doesn't really remove anything from a scene it simply just hides them okay now if you want to and it gets confused so it literally thinks you want to cut this one okay so um, box cutter actually aligns the cutter to this object not this object so if you want to properly hide it right you go to uh, you have to press shift h and this is kind of like a you know um local mode on steroids okay which will hide, hide everything except this object okay and now when i do that you know i can cut uh, in object mode because nothing is in the way yeah so now it's literally properly aligned right so this is the way uh, the only way to do it and then of course you need to go with uh, uh, alt h to unhide it and uh, Bob Jungle, right? So the same thing with decals is the same problem. By the way, this scene is uh, one of, it's a bonus, one of the bonus models, one of the bonus features and content for a, a new product that we're working on with Ducky 3D and Josh. It's gonna be really cool, guys, and I can't, you know, I'm very excited. So I think you guys are gonna love it. By the way, it's gonna be announced later on, very very soon because we're almost done with this one. And anyway, just want to show you this a uh, little trick. That's it guys for this video, hope it helps you out and if you need box cutter or hard ups, uh, you can grab it through the links in the video description and the same with machine tools and other add-ons that I'm using for my daily workflow. So anyway, thanks for watching, catch you next video.